I'm literally laying there rocking with my dog, like, Kobe, please wake up. Kobe, please wake up. It is every pet owner's worst nightmare. Her precious dog, Kobe, died suddenly after a trip to the groomers for a simple nail trim. Four employees are now facing criminal charges tonight. Channel 11's Ryan Houston talked to Kobe's owner, and she told him what investigators say killed her precious pup. A sad story for a dog owner here in the Pittsburgh area. She tells me that she brought her dog here to this PetSmart for a routine grooming. But then, after she came back to pick up her dog, her dog was dead. I felt helpless. I felt angry. I, I wanted to know what did they do to my dog because he was fine moments ago. And then I come in and he's he's just laying there motionless. AJ Ross describes her 12 year old toy poodle Kobe as a ball of energy. But she says that all changed after dropping him off for a routine grooming appointment. Kobe went to get his nails trimmed and when Ross came to pick him up, employees were calling their managers. As I go in, I see him laying there lifeless on the grooming table. The groomers are standing there gawking. The managers are standing there. No one's doing anything. And I'm, I'm just freaking out, like, what happened to my dog? And they, they said he fainted. He, he passed out. Ross tells Channel 11 she rushed Kobe to Bainfield Animal Hospital and after 15 minutes of CPR, they pronounced him dead. So she went back to PetSmart because she suspected what employees told her was not adding up. She requested an autopsy for Kobe and asked to see the surveillance video. And after weeks of calls and emails, PetSmart agreed. So there's one leash that was tethered straight above vertical and another leash that was attached towards the front of the table. So they're contrasting tensions, pulling his neck, hyperextending his neck. According to court paperwork, the Humane Animal Rescue investigation found that the hyperextension of the neck, as well as the lack of contact between Kobe's paws and the grooming table, led to Kobe's airway being crushed, which resulted in his death. PetSmart telling Channel 11 tonight, quote, we are heartbroken by and truly sorry for the loss of Kobe. After this terrible accident, we launched an internal investigation and found unintended failure to adhere to our pet safety processes. Additionally, we cooperated with an external investigation, terminated the responsible associates, and facilitated an autopsy to help provide answers. And Ross tells us PetSmart offered to help her adopt a new dog, but she declined. She tells me that she plans on suing the company after the criminal trial is over. Ryan Houston, Channel 11 News.